our heads in the sand And now we're back drifting Just lonely islands We still swim but we can't see land And so we're on and on and on again Now look at that for a nice view Sun's about to rise now, that should be nice. It's the same old fire. And we can't seem to I think that chimney pot needs replanching. Bit dangerous chimneys, I don't really like them. <laughs> Alright guys, how you doing? Hope you're well. So I'm back on the job, as you can see. Oh, I've been really struggling with the weather. Really struggling. It's been rainy, it's been frosty, and full of flu. Let's give it rain today, but I've, I've got to get it finished, so, because we're in for some cold weather. I've been doing the odd half a day here and there, so, just doing what I can, you know. <clears throat> so we're going to fill this park in here. I'm going to build it over and with the block work on the inside. Okay. I'm going to get the external skin as well sorted. Go over this external skin of block work, get that cavity tray sorted. And yeah, looking pretty good. The joiner's done a fantastic job. His name's Barry. So, and he's, he's, uh, he works with a lad called Stuart. So, they've done a brilliant, absolutely brilliant job. Everything's smack on. That centre line runs straight in with the existing ridge, as you can see. All these spars are running perfect. Just a really good job. Should have been a joiner. <laughs> it's cool wood, isn't it? Anyways, on with the build. Let's crack on. Need to get some insulation down there. We've got to build, we've got to take all these existing roof caps and fascia boards off. And we're taking that wall up, and that will now be the inside skin of of this extension and then we're gonna uh, I think we're gonna clad the outside I'm not quite sure what, what we're doing because we can't get access to the outside um, we'll need it we'll need a big scaffolding job you see for that or something so I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna just block work inside skin and then insulate and clad you know stud it out with some timber and clad it like that over there oh, all right guys I think probably at most a day, a couple of days left, and then I'm, I'm finished on this job. Hopefully Mel can get it washed tight for Christmas, and then get it sorted next year, fully completed. We've done, we've done pretty well, I think, with the weather man. This is the thing with being a bricklayer, I mean, you, you're governed by the weather, so... <laughs> you've got the weather telling you when you can work out, which is not good. Because you can't work in the rain, you can't work in the frost. You can get antifreeze, but chemicals in the mortar, it's up to you if you trust it. Anyways guys, let's crack on. By the way, I've been watching I'm a Celebrity get me out of here. I'm not one for watching TV programmes, but because Amir Khan's in it, I'm one of his fans, I watched it. And I've really enjoyed it, I must admit. And they're just doing the eliminations now, but I think Toff's going to win it because she's a fantastic girl. She's so as a pound and down to earth, and I like girls like her. There's Stanley as well, he's a cool bloke, in his Stanley? Boris Johnson's dad. But yeah, I think Toff is definitely going to win it. So, yeah, well done Toff. Just getting our bits and bats and our blocks and mortarboard set up. So we set our mortarboard up, ready for action when we get a mix on.
So just lining these up, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the block on there, mark it back to hard with a pencil, cut it and then relay it. Got this side up now, got my line up, just run them in. I've had to cut some pockets out here because that's where our ladders are being fixed to with the joiner so every every 1200 just cut some pockets out that's why I've left the gap same at the top there right it's just started raining now so I'm gonna have to back up hi right, guys that's it for today thank you very much for watching I'll see you in the next episode see ya cheers